Here's a thought for you. Everything that you are or ever hope to be is completely up to you. Do you find that thought frightening? Downright scary? Painful? Believe me, you have way more control than you think you do. And the minute, the very minute you take over the reins for your own personal growth and development, is the minute you start taking your game to higher and higher levels. Yes, I know. I know you were born on the wrong side of the track. I know your parents abused and neglected you. The teacher gave you detention and your high school sweetheart broke your heart. Of course, you can make some sound arguments about how your past experiences have negatively impacted your life. But blaming, justifying, complaining, these things will get you nowhere. So here's my advice to you. Stop polishing these experiences and presenting them as if they are the reason why your life isn't working. The harsh truth is you have not yet accepted complete responsibility for your life. News flash, the Calvary isn't coming. While you may need others to help you achieve your goals, the onus is on you to orchestrate your own rescue. As they say, if it is to be, it's up to me. Just imagine an Olympic athlete standing at the start of their event and all they're thinking about is what happened in a competition two months ago, what happened in practice last week, what the coach said to them yesterday. They are there at the start, knowing fully well that their performance in the race is totally within their control today, in this moment, and it is not dictated by some event that happened in the past. You have to let go of your past in order to effectively design your future. In other words, you have to accept yourself and your current circumstances and stop wishing things were different. When I say you should accept your circumstances, it doesn't mean that this is how things will always going to be. It doesn't mean that you no longer set goals, nor does it mean that you should become complacent. That's not acceptance, that's resignation. To resign yourself to your current situation means that you have given up. You have determined that there is no hope. You have determined that this situation that you loathe is your destiny. Is that what you really want? Take a closer look at the word responsibility and you'll notice it's made up of two root words, response and ability. In essence, you have the ability to choose your response to any and all events that take place in your life. Highly successful people recognize this, and so they take responsibility instead of blaming circumstances. They choose to take actions which will create the kind of results they desire. They see setbacks and challenges as opportunities for personal development, allowing them to become stronger, wiser, more knowledgeable, and more skillful. Taking personal responsibility is a price you pay to achieve the greatness you are capable of. Remember, events plus responses equals outcomes. And you always get to choose your responses and hence determine your outcomes. I am Devon Harris and as always, keep on pushing.